Welcome. In today's video, I'll quickly go through POC v11 and what you need to do to ensure you are fully updated. I'll leave any relevant links in the description below. So quickly, what is POC version 11? In simple terms, it is an upgrade to the proof of coverage of the Helium network. It will mainly help to tackle two issues. Number one, spoofing. You might have heard previously that users were hacking the network by purchasing many miners and then placing them in one location. But on the Helium Explorer, they were allocating them to different hexes. The reason they did this was to place the miner location in profitable spaces without having to physically set up a miner in that hex. This resulted in some miners earning insane amount of rewards. The update will assist to verify that hotspots are where they claim and penalize any hotspots that provide inaccurate locations. Number two, transmission regulations. Each country is regulated to transmit a certain power output from your antenna. If you are based in the EU or UK, the legal requirement is a power output of 14 dBm. For the US, it is 36 dBm. To calculate the final power output from your antenna, there are many factors to consider, such as interference, cable loss, and placement. If you are interested in understanding further about calculating the final power output, I have provided a link in the description below. The upgrade will now take into account the antenna DBI that you input into the Helium app. If you have never inputted a DBI, it will be at a default of 1.2, with an antenna height of 0 meters. Remember, if you have already asserted these correctly, you will not require to change the variables. So what are the costs of changing antenna and location placements? The cost to update the location is $10, and the cost to update the antenna DBI is 0.55 cents. If you have already enough HNT within your Helium app, you can skip to the updating and antenna location section provided in the timestamps below. To transfer HNT to your Helium Hotspot app, you can pay with any crypto wallet that supports HNT transfers. I'll be using crypto.com. If you do not have any HNT, you can purchase some using USDC or USDT. Once you have HNT in your wallet, select Accounts. Then select Crypto Wallet and Helium. On the top right, click on Transfer, Withdraw, and then External Wallet. To add your wallet address, you're required to go back into your Helium Hotspot app. Opening up the app, click on the two arrows and select Copy Address. Back into the Crypto.com app, add a wallet address and paste it into the Helium address field. On the wallet name, you can type anything you require and select continue. Type in the password and your two-step verification. Enter the amount you require to send. I am transferring over $20 to be on the safe side as the app takes a small transaction fee of 0.2 HNT. Then select confirm and re-enter your password and two-step verification. You will receive a confirmation screen that the transfer is successful. This does take approximately 15 minutes to go through. Once it has been processed, you should see the amount within your Helium Hotspot wallet. To update the antenna and location, on the home page, click on your miner. Select the settings icon and then click on update hotspot. For the antenna, select the type of antenna that was provided with your hotspot. If you have upgraded the antenna, you can select custom antenna and then type the DBI in manually. If you have calculated how much DBI is lost with consideration to cable loss, interference and so forth, you can input that number within the TX and RX field. Then specify the height of your antenna from the ground. Select update antenna and then submit. Give it a few minutes to update on the blockchain and then you can go back into the app following the same steps, however this time select on update location. Move the white pin to your correct location and then select change location. You are now prepared for the POC v11 update. If you found this content informative, please do give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.